This week on the show, Metal Mania Hot Rod Show. More Metal Mania 2010. And more of the Bikini Show. In the sky, color of you, I love my bed. What's up, dude? Hot rods, Harleys, and horsepower. Kiwi stock. That's what's up. Come on in. Let's check it out. Metal Mania Hot Rod Show. Got his 48 Ford sedan for sale. Grant, tell us a bit about your 48 sedan. Yeah, well, it's um, as I say, it's a 48. It's running a new 350 crate motor in it, um, three-stage auto, and just basic running gear really. Yeah, what? Nine uh, inch in the rear. Nine inch rear. Independent um, front or? Independent front end on it. Um, I don't, I'm not sure of the brand of it, but yeah, independent. Yeah. Um, it's all complete now. It's just really easy upholstery now. Redoing just to suit the rest of the car now. And a new owner, you hope, eh? A new owner, someone that'll love it. Oh, all the best, mate. Awesome, thank you. Cheers. Right, here we are at Bike Out by Wayne Kelly. Wayne, what inspired you to get into this? Um, I was inspired by um, an article I read in the Trader magazine on a lady in America who took it up and found instant success. Although in New Zealand it's a different story, but uh, yeah. And how long have you been doing it, mate? Um, I've been doing it all my life, but it's just a case of don't give up your day job. No. So anyway, I found myself unemployed six months ago and thought I'd try something different. I love bikes, you know, I live to ride myself, so uh, that's it. Oh, oh, wicked, mate. So uh, what, do you, what do you actually ride yourself? Oh. Anything presently? <laughs> yeah, uh, it's a Japper, I'm afraid, but uh, yeah, no, I'm really happy. It's a 1350 V-Twin, got all the grunt I need. Yeah, I see that most of your inspiration comes from Harley-Davidson's. Yeah, yeah. That's where it all began, eh? That's right. But uh, you've got to be wealthy to own a Harley, so I'll have to sell a few paintings first. Hey, good luck, mate. Good yeah. talking with you. This one here takes us back a wee bit to where it all began. This is a 1937 Flathead 750 Harley. Harley first were uh, introduced 
in 1903 and developed into the uh, V-twin as we know commonly today. This 1937 model is a classic example of where Harley-Davidson came from. There's a bit of a joke about uh, this particular model around this period was the air cleaner was commonly referred to as a lady's hair dryer when in fact in 1937 women didn't even know that a hair dryer was going to exist. We're here with Peter James and his 11 bikes from his collection. Peter, tell me a bit about your collection. Oh, well these were actually uh, handed down from my uh, brother who uh, passed away in a plane accident. Um, he had them stored in Wellington, all on top of each other and he didn't have much room so um, I built a shed on the orchard, air conditioned it. They're all climate controlled and slowly got them back to original condition and yeah and had it on when I can. Um, it is getting quite expensive to do now these days because everyone knows how much what you know what everything's worth so yeah but we go from 1905 behind you there right up to uh, 84 for the Ducati. Um, yeah. Yeah this Triumph we're uh, standing over is not unlike the model I basically learned to ride on, I learned to ride on a, a bathtub model Tiger 21, uh, Tiger, no, uh, yeah, Tiger 21. Uh, this is a, a Tiger 100. Just fill us in a little bit about this one. Yeah, well this was actually uh, brought brand new by my brother, converted to a race bike, and it's done Wanganui, Gracefield, Pyrrua, and had quite a few victories actually. A really nice bike to race. Good talking with you Peter, nice collection mate. Now back to Metal Mania 2010 Bikini Show. Check out Hot Rods and Harleys.co.nz. This is Kieran Guinness for Hot Rods, Harleys and Horsepower Kiwi Style. See you next time. Probably get the slippy is not my fault. <laughs>